Uh, we should have had uh, Survivor playing, right? The yeah. Eye of the Tiger. Mm -mm -mm. Mm -mm 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 -mm. Hey everybody, this is Matt Fish, the owner and founder of Melt Barn Grilled. We are here with a big, big announcement. We are bringing you the 2020 Melt Adventure election results today live at Melt Barn Grilled. It is Monday, November the 2nd. We are talking about the most important election that our country has seen this year. We are bringing you the winner of the 2020 Meltadential election. But first, we all know it's been a rough year, not only for the restaurant industry, but every single person out there who's hopefully watching or gonna be watching this. So thank you guys for all of your support, but thank you to my staff. My staff has been there with us this entire time and has brought comfort food deliciousness to every single person that has needed it during this pandemic. So let's get through 2020 strong. Let's get it, let's do it. But also a thank you to everybody out there in Meltland who has supported us and supported our staff through this whole thing. We are only here today because of you guys, because of your support through all this pandemic, through this craziness of 2020. Let's hope 21 is a better year for everybody. But without further ado, let's get into the Melt Election, the Meltadential Election 2020 fun. I am so proud, so happy, so excited to announce the winner of our Cheese of Staff contest. We started a contest back in August. We re asked, we asked the people of Melt, the fans of Melt, we said, tell us why you deserve to be the Cheese of Staff. What is your favorite thing about Melt? What, what is gonna make you the most important person, uh, part of this cabinet that's gonna be in ruling here at Melt Bar and Grill for the next four years. And I'm happy to announce after hundreds of entries, literally we combed through hundreds of entries, a lot of good ones out there. So everybody that did participate in the contest, thank you guys, you really went for it this year, it was awesome. But there was a clear cut winner, clear cut cheese of staff of Melt Bar and Grill. I am happy to announce my core, He's coming in here, he's gonna give his acceptance speech. He's gonna talk a little bit about his love for Melt Bar Grill. I'm gonna step away, he's gonna step in, and then I'll be back to announce the winner of the 2020 Melt Adential election. Mike, get in here, introduce yourself to the people. Thank you, Matt. So I'm Mike Hoare, and I prefer, or prepared a few words. Um, you know, it's been a long journey getting here. I've campaigned across this country, and several other countries. In fact, it was a dark, cold day in Toronto, Ontario, when I was born to the sounds of Veal Diamond in the hospital room. You see, cheese has always been a part of my life. And so it wasn't that long after that that I ended up eating sharp cheddar cheese, grilled cheese sandwiches, and learning terrible jokes. And I tell you one right now, but I can't bear any one. You know, from Toronto, I ended up in Arkansas, then Memphis, Tennessee, Philadelphia, where despite being a vegetarian for 30 plus years, I got to enjoy a cheesesteak, a vegan cheesesteak, and the wonderful goodness that is Philadelphia sharp provolone cheese. And if you haven't had it, there's nothing like it. From there, I ended up in the DC area, and then finally in the Cleveland area, where Melt Bar and Grilled was the first restaurant that I ever went to here. I was blown away by the beer, the sandwiches, the music, and of course the staff. And so, since I've been elected the Melt Cheese of Staff, I promise the following things to you. I will continually comment on all the Instagram posts that I see. I will bring in friends from across the world and across the city to enjoy not only the sandwiches, but the custom sandwiches that you can make by adding on things such as tofu and fried mozzarella. And so, thank you for this opportunity. Thank you for listening to my podcast. I feel like the gospel of grilled cheeses, mac and cheese, and the like must be spread. And so thanks again. And if you don't mind, I'm going to cheese it out of here. Woo. Ladies and gentlemen, Mike Hoare, the Cheese of Staff 2020. Mike will be as a cabinet member for the next four years. So you're gonna see him a lot probably on Instagram and our social media. Mike's not going away. He's got a lot of important duties over the next four years. So we're gonna see a lot of that guy. So thank you, sir, very much. But now the most important announcement 
probably of the year. I know everyone at home has been waiting anxiously. You're on the edge of your seats. You're sitting there. You cannot wait for this announcement. There were a lot of candidates this year. I think we have eight different candidates that were vying for the president of Mount Barn and Grill. As you know, the incumbent was running the uh, the Dudabides who had won back in 2016. Well, this year we had a a very tight race up until the end. It was between the Dudabides and the Monte Cristo, and it was seriously neck and neck. It was a photo finish, but with 51.3% of the popular vote, ladies and gentlemen of Meltland, I give you the Monte Cristo, who is your president of Melt Bar Grill now, 20. 20 and the president of Mel is going to say a few words. I bring the mic in for you, sir. I give you the president of Mel Barn Grill. Good morning, fellow citizens of Melt Nation. I am Monte Cristo, and I am humbled and honored to be your next Melt Hunt. I want to make one thing clear I do not rule. I serve. I am here to serve you, the passionate and dedicated fans of Melt Bar and Grill. Just like Melt has been serving gourmet comfort food for over a decade, we both exist to serve you the best grilled cheese on the planet, or universe, or anywhere else. You had an important choice in this election, a candidate that abides, or one that's deep fried. You have chosen wisely. By electing me as melted into it, you have shown that it is time to bring opposites together, just like my blend of sweet and meat. My combination of gooey American and Swiss cheese that's been deep fried. Yes, friends, let us come together and eat. I would like to thank my opponents for all they have done to contribute to the awesomeness of Melt Nation. They are all tasty and delicious in their own unique ways, but you have spoken, which is kind of amazing because it's hard to speak with a mouthful of grilled cheese, am I right? Thanks also go out to my mouth-watering running mates, Buffalo Chicken Shower and Fathead's Bumblebee. Buffalo Chicken Shower's pulled chicken blue cheese, celery, carrots, and banana peppers, and bumbleberry's sweet, refreshing flavor really brought our ticket together. So in closing, I am ready to lead Melt Nation into a new, deep-fried, golden brown age. Let's take this delicious journey together. Thank you, and good bites! <laughs> Wise words from our new president at Mel Farm Grill. Wise words, sir. You are going to rule with power, dignity, and spunk for another 40 years. Ladies and gentlemen, that wraps up our time together today. I would like to thank everybody, A, for voting this year, for participating in the 2020 Mel Natural election. I want to thank all the candidates, all their deliciousness. But mostly, thank you to you guys at home. You guys make everything possible here at Mel Farm Grill, so we could not do what we do without you. Thank you so much for all of your support this year. And don't forget the vote tomorrow. The real vote is happening on Tuesday. So let's get out there and vote, everybody. See you guys at Melt. I the Tiger.